These ABB robots on display at the SPS trade fair in Germany might look impressive, but what's really exciting about this demonstration is how they're being controlled. Traditionally, robots in an industrial setting would have their own controller, their own control cabinet, and often their own engineers. Essentially, they were a completely independent part of the surrounding process. But these have been completely integrated with the surrounding machine control architecture. That means these robots are a native part of the automation solution, communicating with the associated machine systems at the microsecond level. That's something that was previously unimaginable. The result is a system that has unprecedented synchronization and for the user, one that opens up whole new possibilities. For our customers, we have a unique portfolio because we are the only one that can provide the full portfolio from the server motion to the controllers, to the robot, all integrated into one system that helps our customers not only be more flexible, but it's easier to use, simpler to install and gives them more flexibility. This full integration offers more possibilities uh, in making machines faster and uh, also offers a lot of advantages to the end user as the end user is not seeing a robot as a machine and, a, and the actual machine, uh, the end user sees one solution. This integrated solution is the first major result of ABB's acquisition in 2017 of BNR, who make a range of factory automation systems, including a kind of control computer called a Programmable Logic Controller, or PLC. Merging this kind of process machine with robots means the whole system is faster, more user-friendly and far more flexible, so that each unit produced in a factory can be done to different specifications. As researchers from ABB and BNR continue to collaborate, they say this is just the start of the possibilities opened up by bringing together factory automation with advanced robotics.